Hi guys, my name is Christian Blume. I'm from Denmark. My name is uh, Thomas Olsen. My name is Gert. I live in Westerlo in Belgium. My name is Steven. I live in Belgium. These days were um, one word incredible. I will uh, get an answer in every competition in the future, hopefully winning again. It, it, it has been very fantastic. It was uh, for me uh, really a once in a lifetime experience. Awesome opportunity and great to have Ulrich Scott opening the doors for this kind of thing. It was uh, a dream come true to be as close as I was, as we were, um, to the riders, to the team. I, I will hope it could uh, last uh, some, <laughs> yeah, two or three days more because it, it is very, very fantastic. Uh, so many uh, impressions, uh, new things, and and when you love cycling and you have always watched them in in television, and and they, yeah sit next to them and talk to them and ride with them and that is fantastic. At Moriwi, seeing the women finish and then seeing all the three uh, the three passes of uh, of the peloton and and and, and all the, all the famous riders before seeing the finish and we were standing just uh, I mean 2 meters away from the finish line. It was just awesome. Completely awesome. It was so great. And today, to top it off, was, in my case, uh, the best day of my life, almost. Second to my wedding day, <laughs> I must say. But um, it was incredible, uh, riding with the guys and being able to talk to them, riding super cool bikes. Yeah, just just incredible, unbelievable. We, we did the ride and I was talking to Chris Yule, I was talking to uh, Elpa on the way, I was talking to, to uh, Jarens. And I mean, it's just completely easy going, guys. And uh, we were talking about some of the races and some of the sportifs that the rest of us can do when we have, have some, some time off. So it was really very familiar atmosphere and it was really, really cool and very, very nice. I thought these guys would be like rock stars or maybe a little, more, a little bit more to themselves, but the guys were really open. They were uh, friendly. They answered the questions uh, we asked them. They were normal guys. For me, this is a one in a lifetime experience, experience that I can uh, tell to my uh, to my children when I when I'm uh, 80 or something. It's it's still in my in my heart, in my brains. Yeah, it will follow me everywhere. I think. I said to Stephen, my friend who was uh, here with me, that uh, every hour of this these days I'm gonna say look at him and say. Man, what the f is this? Um, and it, and it happened uh, every day. There was something that, that that was happening, especially today, but also yesterday when we witnessed uh, the the race from uh, so close by. I was like, is this really happening? Pinch me because I must be I must be dreaming. But uh, unbelievable, and a uh, dream come true. That's uh, the two words I the, the two things I would like to say. Yeah.